Hey! Hey everyone, my name is Riley and I wanted to film a little video for you today. I wanted to give you guys some date ideas for regressors and carers. So if you are a regressor or a carer and are looking for some date ideas for you and your big or your small, here are six ideas just for you. Date idea number one is Build-A-Bear. If you're a carer, you can take your little to this wonderful, magical place and have them make a best friend. You guys can even do the little heart ceremony together so both of your love is put into this stuffy and it'll be super duper cute. Plus, it's super fun and I know for me at least, whenever I walk into a Build-A-Bear, it's like an instant regression trigger. And then you can even add a scent or a sound to your stuffy and maybe you can even have your care record a cute little voice message to put in their paw so when you click it you can hear it. I also have heartbeats in all of my stuffies from Build-A-Bear and that just makes them feel alive and like a really good friend. So Build-A-Bear is suggestion number one. Number two is go and have a picnic and a picnic doesn't have to just be outdoors if it's the winter or if it's too cold or if you don't have a nice area to take a picnic in. You can do a picnic on the floor of a living room. It doesn't really matter where. You can prepare your small's favorite food, but if you are gonna be outside, just make sure it's the portable food, like a sandwich. But if you're inside, it can be mac and cheese, spaghetti, dino nuggets, whatever your small wants. And you can set up a blanket on the ground, you can get a little picnic basket, you can set up some stuffies around if you're inside. And you guys can just sit down on the ground and have a really lovely small meal together. Suggestion number two. Three is to go to a museum. There are tons of different kinds of museums, which is perfect for smalls who have a variety of interests. And I know that children's museums are also a really, really great option because it's kitty, it's like a regression trigger, and it's really, really fun because a lot of the kids' museums are interactive. And if you don't go to a kids' museum, you and your small can go learn about art, you can learn about history, you can learn about whatever the museum you're going to is about and learning can be super fun and the cool thing about this date idea is that it is an awesome date idea for a full day of stuff usually museums take like a full day to walk around and read all the little tidbits and information so just for the price of getting into the museum you get a full day of fun suggesting number four is to go to the park parks are fun for both bigs and smalls especially if it's nice and warm outside where you are. Another great thing about going to the park is that it's free. So if you are on a budget, going to a park is a really, really good idea to expel some of your small's energy and to hang out and play with them, but at a minimal or no cost. You can swing on the swings, you can climb on all the structures, you can go down the slides, and it's a really, really great way to also get some exercise in. Suggestion number Number five is to go see a movie. There's almost constantly a kids movie or a Disney movie in theaters at all times. So this isn't one that you necessarily have to particularly schedule. So if there's a movie that you and your small are interested in and Disney movies are always a good, there are usually other kids movies, whether it be DreamWorks or something else. And the little kitty popcorn sets that come with like gummies and a little drink are super fun for your small and they're cheaper than buying the big popcorn and drinks but you guys can go sit next to each other hold hands do whatever you want to do and watch a wonderful movie my last date idea number six is to visit an animal shelter usually most animal shelters will let you come and visit the animals for free and a lot of them also let you play with some of the animals which is really
really good because then some of the animals get playtime in. You and your small can play with the cute puppy or kitty. And being around animals and playing with animals and petting animals is like a scientifically proven really great stress reliever and like increases serotonin levels and it makes you like super happy. And again, most shelters let you do this for free. So again, if you're on a budget, this is a really, really great and fun option. Those are my date ideas for regressors and carers. I hope you heard of something new, a new idea that maybe you and your care or you and your small can go on. Be sure if you enjoyed this video to click that subscribe button down below because I post about once a week a bunch of different regression -y content. And if you want to keep up with me day to day, you can follow all my social medias which are linked down below. If you also want to support me and my content, my Ko-Fi is also linked below as well as my wish list. I love you guys a whole heckin' lot and I will see you soon. Goodbye!